Russian media have confirmed the loss of another Su-35 fighter jet. On Monday, February 19, PSU Commander Mykola Olschuk reported the downing of two Russian tactical aircraft, a Su-34 frontline bomber and a Su-35 multi-purpose fighter. Petro Andriyashenko, an advisor to the mayor of Mariupol, published a video from the occupied village of Rybatsk where the tail part of the Su-35 fighter jet is lying in the water. At the same time, according to the intercepted conversations of the Russian rescuers, the pilot of this plane is lying face in the water and it is unlikely that he is engaged in snorkeling in the cold waters of the February Sea of Azov. Thus, in addition to the two planes in the Russian Federation, at least minus two pilots. After all, the information about the downing of planes in these areas directly indicates that the Air Force of Ukraine is already methodically implementing long-range anti-aircraft capabilities that have not yet been officially announced. In particular, the place of ejection of one of the Su-34 crew members is 60 kilometers from the current front line, and the fall of the Su-35 is 80 kilometers away. 